This is tutorial number 29, and it covers how to select your materials for your parts within Autodesk Inventor. Now to start off, let's open up a part file. Let's click File, and let's open up the materials part, which I've included on the DVD. Now what we're going to do is we're going to select a material for different parts in here. So we're going to select a material for this part, we're going to select one for this part, and we're going to select a material for these two parts together. So to start off, let's select this part. So let's click Extrusion 1. And to select the part, all we have to do is click up here. And we're able to choose from a list, this whole list here. So for the first one, let's choose Aluminum Polished. So let's click it. And now when we zoom in, you can see that the part has the texture and the color of the polished aluminum. Now when you give a part a material, it gets the color, the texture, and it also gets the properties of that material. So for stress and strain, and when you do analysis, it will have th those properties. Now let's choose this part here. So let's choose mirror one. And let's choose a material for it. So from down here, let's scroll down. And let's choose aluminum 6061 machined. So let's click it. And now that material, that part has that material with the color, the texture, and the materials properties. Now let's select these two. So let's click Mirror 2. We'll open up all the materials, scroll down to the bottom. And here you can also pick different kinds of wood. And it'll actually give the wood color, texture, and material the characteristics. So let's choose the ash. Let's click it. And now the part has the color, the texture, and the properties of the wood. And that concludes our tutorial on how to select materials for your parts within Autodesk Inventor.